What's poppin' people? Welcome back to another episode of Kicking Their Bass TV. Today, we're with Monster Michael Todd. What's up, brother? World champion arm wrestler. Tell me a little bit about yourself. Man, so uh, I just asked how old you are. So I've been arm wrestling eight years longer than you've been alive. So at 17 years old, I started a small county fair in Arkansas. And now I've traveled the world, uh, won 21 world titles in the heavyweight and super heavyweight division, and then 36 national titles over six different weight classes. That is amazing, man. Yeah, it's been a lot it's of fun, so man. Cool. Just, it's, because that's that redneck thing you did growing up, yeah. arm wrestling on hoods and trucks, picnic <laughs> tables. And I turned it into a way to travel the world and see a lot of interesting that's places, awesome. meet a lot of interesting people. So it's so awesome. You love it. Oh, Passion it's a blast. It's a blast. Yes, favorite sir. Favorite thing to do. Yeah, we're in a nationwide oh. tour right now, traveling the United States, taking on all comers. So having a blast. So if you guys are new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, also hit the like button. If you guys have been enjoying the content, go check out his page down below. I'll link him in everything. But we're gonna go head to the lake. Let's have some fun today. Are yes, we gonna sir. be doing any arm wrestling? I think we shall. I think we shall. All right. So we're gonna go fishing <laughs> first. Kind of, kind of get it broken in. Yeah, kind of warm up. Warm up some fishing. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's get it. So where are you from? Hot Springs, Arkansas. How far is that from here? I haven't drove straight here, so I have no clue. How's the fishing in Arkansas? Real good, actually. Um, I'm gonna just be as transparent as possible. I have not held a fishing rod in 40 years. Really? Yeah. Well, that makes it even better today. Yeah, so I mean, I grew up on the lake. So you haven't caught a fish in it before. I don't know, you haven't. <laughs> no. Uh -uh. So I grew up on the lake oh, as a kid, and my dad always wanted me to go fishing. And uh, we also had a pool, so I was like, yeah, Dad, go ahead. I'm just going to hang out here and swim in the pool. Yeah. So I never really got into it. And it's probably because I didn't have a lot of patience, you know. So, But if you're catching fish, it's amazing. Yeah. But just sitting yeah. around there, I just wasn't the dude. Sure. So when he told me about this, I'm like, yeah, that sounds like a good thing to go do. Because it just wasn't something I was ever into as a kid. So yeah. it's something to be fun to try now. Sure. That's cool. Yeah. Especially someone who's experienced that, you know. Yeah. So you ready to get it started? I guess so. I First guess. time in 40 years. 40 years. So well, how do you do yeah. this? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's get it. All right. So we're going to get it started today. This is the pole that I'm going to set you up with. All right. So this, this is, is the one, huh? Combo. The yeah. spinning combo. So pretty much you got your hook tied onto your line. All right. You got your weight on the front. Okay. Which slides all the way down. Then you got your bait that is on the hook. And this is weedless, so you're not going to hook anything. Gotcha. See how you can't. Oh, that's cool. So when they bite down on it, though, and you go to hook set, you know it's going to get them. Gotcha. So so I'm not accidentally going to get got. No. All right. <laughs> so how common is it as you're doing the little trolling motor thing that someone fall off the side of this? I'm going to be honest, it's never happened. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't happen today. If it does, Hopefully I hope I'm recording. recording. I hope you're filming. I yeah. hope you're yeah. filming. Oh, shoot. Dude, that's perfect. All right. Perfect. So now yeah, look. Let's lead it out a little bit. Yeah, let it out a little bit, and then you see you're already on the bottom. See all your lines not moving. Right. So you want to roll it up. Or yeah, close the bell first, and then kind of reel it tight, and um, reel up your slack a little more. Now kind of give her a hop, and you'll feel a fish bite. You got one? I or you want a rock? No. Uh, rock. Yeah. And you'll kind of feel them tick it. Yeah. You know, to kind of feel like a little, and sometimes it's a little softer than usual, but. Yeah, when I felt that first little tug, I'm like, oh man, I already got one. Great. Yeah. <laughs> Hold this real quick. I'm going to show you the range of yeah. motion. Okay, so that's as far as my arm goes out. Come that's on. It. That's it. That's straight. That's bone on bone. Now so that's ready? literally. That's it. Are you ready for the crazy one? Yeah. We jokingly say the reason I have a beard is because it can't touch my face. That's it. So you literally only got this that's middle it. motion. Bone bone yeah i've lost 19 and a half inches range of motion it's horrible so he's talking about don't hurt oh your my arm gosh. if i ever fall or trip i never because my wrist won't bend back yeah so i never try to catch myself i just tuck and roll because i gotta protect that money maker you know what i'm saying <laughs> <laughs> gotta protect that money maker all right so we got him all set up up there let me Go see on. this cast before i rig up watch this he's a professional Look at that. Beautiful. Perfect cast. I'm impressed, man. Every cast you've thrown has been like really good. So we're gonna, if you guys are wondering what I'm gonna be using, it's a little rage crawl. And uh, this is in blue bug. If you guys watched one of the recent vlogs, you can go check it out down below. We uh, bought a lot of tackle at Bass Pro. 
So I'm just gonna be putting this on one fourth ounce bullet weight, three extra wide gap hook. And we're gonna toss this around for a little bit. See if we can find some fish out here on the main river. More importantly, get him on some fish, get him to catch his first bass in 40 years. So that'd be fun. so funny you cast it three times to my one <laughs> like, okay he's, he's really fast at that i'm just really uh sometimes i'm a little too fast i'll do the same thing with cody he's a little more patient than me it's good to work it slow though that's dude that was a good cast man. i felt like that was a pretty good one honestly yeah, really <laughs> there's a technique with it where you go low that was pretty you know you can yeah. get get right up in there so i'm probably not pulling that one off uh oh you got him yep Right in that cubby hole too. Here we go, brother. We got something. Now we got this one. These fish fight hard out here too, man. Do they? They fight so good. You know they live in this current, so they're so strong. Yeah. So uh, I'm actually gonna put these. Those are shallow water anchors in the back. They're called power poles. Okay. I'm gonna lock us down for a minute. There we go. Check him out. The first fish. Pretty, yeah. pretty cool. I mean, you see the color of the water is kind of tannic, right? You know, kind of brown looking, but it's still clear, so it kind of gives them that huh. that nice glow. Yeah, but that's not a bad fish at all, is it? So there we go. We got the first fish today. Nothing big, good little pound and a half, or a nice bass. It's no, cool, ain't yeah, it? Yeah, it's awesome. That it's was a pretty fish. It's pretty neat when you caught it too. I was like, oh, you got one. Yep. But uh, get them back in the water. Let them swim another day. Always promote catch and release with these bass. Now we got to get Monster Michael Todd on a fish, man. Here we go. Here it's we your go, time, too. baby. No. Not too bad. I'm probably in your way a little bit too, huh? I was definitely gonna blame you on that one. <laughs> that bad, isn't it? If Cody would have been there. I would have nailed that. Oh, I got one. Oh, you Get got it. him. Oh, oh you got to set the hook a little bit harder. Oh, it. <laughs> <You're all good. laughs> like, it's a winner. Oh. You look good. There you go. Oh, I don't want to catch that one, but you got him. Oh man, it's another nice little bass. There's some good ones. I mean, they're not yeah. bad. And look how pretty that fish is. Just like you got a nice colors on them. Right. Just in this tannic water, living out here. Pretty fish. They're really fat and healthy. There you go, second bass. There you go. See, there's fish in here. They are. Yeah. <laughs> they don't like me. <laughs> they're good in here. Times, though. What in the world is that? I'm sure if these fish had arms, you'd have something to do to them. Yeah, yeah. I know, right? They'd be in trouble, <laughs> That's a pretty fish, though. Yeah. Oh, nice. There should be one up in there. See, the spot looks so good. And like I said, it's all a timing thing with that water coming in. You can tell they're biting a little better. Well, I missed my shot on that one. There you go. That's a great cast. That's great. Oh, did, did he have them? Kind of looked like it. It looked like it started to run with it. All right, three more casts. Three more. Three more. Get you one more under here, and then we'll get two up front. There you go. One fish. Did he buy it? Yeah. Here, let me fix your bait. Did they get it? Was he on it? He might have. He might have bit it. Yeah, Flip it got, back. Oh, no. Uh, no. Uh, no. <laughs> he was right there. Good try, though. Let me let me get your bait. He might eat it again. Did you see how far he was running with it? Yeah. Because you landed. See, so you landed in that corner, and he had taken it all the way to the left. All right. Last cast. Last cast of the day, guys. A little shady spot. That corner. Yeah. Go for the right shady spot. There. Right here. Fill in shape. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. That's a good cast, right? That's still a good one. You want to go about three foot to the right. 
that was it for the day, guys. I don't know. You always got to make one more after the last one for good luck. Is that how it works? One more in that shade for good <laughs> luck. The shade. All right. This is it. Either way, it's been a great time having you on the yeah. on the boat. Have, thank you guys for sharing this day with me. Make me feel like a kid again. There you go, dude. <clears throat> He's been accurate like his last like 20 casts. Yeah. Perfect. Come on, fish. Please. Please bite him right here. <laughs> Well, <coughs> it's been fun, we guys. Gave it all. We, gave it we did, all. we did. Now it's time to go get on the arm wrestling yes, table. Yes, let's go arm wrestling. All right, guys, we had a blast out here, man. Thank you uh, so had a much great for coming time, out. Man. Thanks I for having fun. me. Um, yeah. It was tough. You know, we had some some bites here and there, but you know, we only had a little bit over an hour out here. But we had a good time. It's just well, you hot. caught a couple of fish. You looked yeah, I got, awesome. I got a few. Um, you had a few good bites, and he was just getting the casting down so good at the end there. You, I'm, I'm actually pretty proud of my casting. I'm, you you was, did a great like, job. Man, I think I could go This is what I'm going to do. When I get these <laughs> new rods in, I'm going to send you one. All right. So you go fishing back home, you send me a picture. I will do that. The Absolutely. Now. But, um, man, we're going to go over to Nine Line now. He's going to whip out his arm wrestling table, and I'm going to teach him a lesson. You know, listen, I know I'm half his size, but we got to make it happen. You're, you're almost half my size. got to make it happen. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and take the boat out of the water. I'll catch you guys there. He's going to teach us a little bit about arm wrestling. All right. All right, just meet it out the nine line and look at his beast right here. Check it got out. Got him an old wrapped RV as there well. There you go, nationwide tour, Dude, taking sweet. on all comers. You're the next victim. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is awesome. If you guys ever see him, make sure you go by and say, hey, it did a cool job, man. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Uh, like I said, once the Hummer gets wrapped behind it, it'll be a lot easier to access the table right now. I got, I've got a breakdown table, got to put back together. Uh, once the Hummer's there, we'll just pop to the back and pull a fully, fully put together table out, throw it down and start taking on pullers, you know. You know, you think about arm wrestling, everybody's arm wrestled, right? But you never think of it as like this competitive, right? So it's just cool to see this side of it. And um, man, I've had a good time today. We had a blast on the water. I wish he would have got a fish, but now he gets to beat me in arm wrestling. So <laughs> it's gonna be fun. So first thing is you want to chalk your hand. So we got your own chalk here because you want to make sure you don't slip out. Yep. And if you do slip out, we put the strap on. So you can get on that side of the table. We just went fishing. I had a great time. Terribly unsuccessful though. Um, this guy was awesome. He did amazing. But now we're gonna teach you guys a little bit about arm wrestling. Come up, put your elbow on the table. How would you normally arm wrestle? Put your hand on the hand peg? Yeah. How would you normally arm wrestle me? Yeah, normally. You're just gonna pull, push sideways, yeah. right? So that's the way everyone started out arm wrestling. But once you get into the sport of arm wrestling, there's a lot more pulling involved. So it's more like a tug of war. Our hands gotta start in the center of the table. If you think about it, if you pull me closer to you, I'm losing leverage, you got more leverage. So that's the first thing you wanna do, you wanna to try to get me to your side of the table. So I'm gonna let you do your normal thing. I'm gonna ease you down, so don't quit. I'm gonna yeah. ease you down, and I'll show you, show you what you need to be doing, okay? All right. Ready, go. All right. So you're going good sideways, everything looks good, so I want a little bit more back pressure this way. Pull it. Yep. Ready, go. Mm. Yeah, okay. Stay in, stay in, stay in, stay in. <laughs> so what I'm doing is to keeping you safe now. Yep. Because of the way you're new to arm wrestling, it only if your hand goes past your shoulder or you look away, it only takes like 14 pounds of pressure for that little bone to break. Really? The humerus, right? Um, and you don't see it a lot, but you'll see these videos on YouTube how somebody breaks their arm. Oh, it's his elbow. No, it's normally it's two inches right above the elbow. So that's from all that torque. So what I'm doing is pulling you out to keep you safe. Cool. One more time, get in nice and tight and try to go all the way for the pin. Ready, go. That's good. You're picking it up, pick it up. Stay in, I'm gonna <clears throat> ease you. Oh, okay, well, that's good. All right, so. It's so like once I get off. Yeah, it's an elbow foul, but we're not calling it. All right, ready, go. See, that's much better. I mean, you've already picked this up pretty good. So, just like all, going back. all your buddies arm wrestle them just like that. Maybe you two should arm wrestle real quick. You wanna <laughs> you try and go ready? for it? Yeah, I'm down. Well, all right, well, I'll be the camera guy. Okay. I'll be the camera guy. <laughs> ready, go. Breathe, face your hand. Always look at your hand, always look at your hand. Drag back now as hard as you can. Uh oh, oh, I think Cody might have your hand. Man. <laughs> you are working it. Now don't mess up those bass fishing arms. You still gotta throw out that You're rod. Me down, buddy. <laughs> oh, oh, he's talking. Noah's talking. 
you seen it here kicking their bass is more than just bass fishing we got the arm wrestling championship of savannah right here oh <laughs> winner God, <laughs> good dog. times guys all right ah. so now the what y'all get for that prize is you both get to arm wrestle me okay oh, that might have been too much <laughs> <laughs> Go, Cody. God. <laughs> Are they gonna wear out? Who's gonna win? Who's gonna win? I can't get it down on my angle. I'm done, oh. bro. All right. God. I didn't lose. I didn't win, but I didn't lose. <laughs> Man, you're a strong guy, dude. Ah, Give me some props. I appreciate it. Props. Yeah, my, I didn't have enough strength to to hook those fish, but uh, so you, you still got it. I had, a, I had a lo another, <laughs> enough left for the table, though. Apparently, enough left for the table. So yeah, it's cool times. Good times, but, man. Um, if you guys want to check out his page or his channel, link will be down below. If you guys want to see him back on the channel, let us know. Get this video to 10,000 likes. I know we can do it. And uh, drop some comments down below on what other people you guys want to see on the channel. Thank you so much, appreciate brother. It, brother. And, be uh, blessed. I will catch you guys yes, sir. in the next video.